A Sarasota neighborhood near the North Siesta Key Bridge has had its fair share of crimes recently and over the last few years as well. ABC 7's Rick Adams is telling us where these crimes have been happening and how neighbors are reacting. Well, a string of burglaries here in the San Ramo development has put a lot of folks on edge. For people who live here, they're hopeful things like the neighborhood crime watch will help. The beautiful San Ramo Estates, with its 67 homes, sits on the bay right near Siesta Key. It's a neighborhood that has experienced at least seven property crimes this year and around a dozen crimes such as burglaries in the last couple of years. Attempted break-ins, um, car theft. We had one actual successful car theft, people breaking into cars and stolen mail. Um, and it just is happening with a, a rate and a frequency that's a lot greater than it's been in the past. For residents like Steve Clavette, these numbers are very concerning. He's lived in San Ramo for about two years. We're deeply concerned with the level it is right now. Um, we're all from, we're, we're transients, we're from Midwest, we're from the East Coast, wherever. And we're not used to seeing these kind of things happen. San Ramo resident Bob Petak says part of the problem is that there's been a large drop in the number of police officers with the Sarasota Police Department compared to a few years ago. He and others are pushing the city for a big increase in the police force. The more the police are made visible, um, you know, there's going to be less crime. Um, is it going to stop all the crime by having more police officers? No, but they're certainly going to be able to keep it under better control. Police say a lot of these burglaries could be prevented, especially if people are a little more diligent. In any neighborhood, in anywhere today, we're asking our neighbors to make sure they lock their houses, lock all their doors, and lock their cars. And if you do see anything suspicious in this neighborhood or in any neighborhood, you're being asked to contact your local police department or sheriff's office immediately. Reporting from Sarasota, I'm Rick Adams, ABC7, your Suncoast News. Thank you, Rick.